Sounding the alarm, a driver says that her debit card was charged $400, that to cover the price of a parking ticket that she received in downtown Grand Rapids. She tells us it wasn't her fault. She claims the parking company dropped the ball before she found her car with a device suction cup to her windshield. News 8's Donovan Long explains what happened. Meet the barnacle. I'm freaking out. It's a jarring and frankly costly piece of plastic a parking attendant placed on Emily Schimmelman's car. It happened at this Holiday Inn controlled lot last month. I was definitely kind of just very upset about it. Then I was just kind of angry, I guess. Schimmelman says she did everything in her power to prevent this. She followed the instructions, texting three letters to the number provided on this sign. She says she did not receive a response with instructions to pay to park. She shows me the text message thread. Still, no reply. There's nothing. Yeah. Oh, man. After waiting 10 minutes, the 21-year-old says she left her car to explore downtown Grand Rapids with her friend Marie, only to return and find the unexpected suction cupped to her windshield. My friend Marie looked over and she's like, Emily, this is $400. And I was like, no, no, you joke. Like, there's no way. No joke, it is. The general manager of this Holiday Inn confirming that Air Park, the company the hotel contracts to enforce parking, owns the barnacles. The GM telling News 8 the company charges drivers an initial fee of $400 if they receive the barnacle and then reimburses half once they remove and replace it in a barnacle drop box like Schimmelman did. Luckily had $200. If, if I didn't, I don't know what I would have done. The Holiday Inn GM says she hasn't received any complaints like Schimmelman's, but says she would have contacted Air Park and advocated on her behalf had she known of Schimmelman's problem. Did this whole experience kind of sour your your future plans of going downtown? Yeah, a little bit. Now, the general manager of this hotel says it only costs two dollars an hour to park in this lot. She adds that this is one of three lots in downtown Grand Rapids in our area that use these barnacles to enforce parking. And we should point out that anyone who tries to park here overnight will be towed. We well, are live in downtown Grand Rapids. Donovan Long, News 8. All right. The barnacle. That's a new one. Thank you, Donovan.